to the Casa. How are we doing tonight? How's everybody doing? Strict Saving Bundle. Let's get her done. I do have the fan one. I hope it doesn't mess with the mess with the video, the stream. I might have to lower it down so it's not in the video. But I'm here. Are you there? Luke, I'm your father. Or it won't go down any further. All right. Let's see here. There we go. Uh, let's see here. I can sit off to the side. Oh, bump in the camera. There. Let's move it around a little bit. How's everybody doing? I just started your new video. Guess I'll have to get back to it later. Sorry, Tim. Thanks for coming over to the Casa. I gotta slow this fan down. <laughs> All right. Got some show and tell. Faith, how are you? Alex, how you doing? So if you came to the Commander Legends box, there's a special giveaway. I'm going to wait until more people get in here to show off the cards that you're going to be winning. But it was only, uh, let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight people. So I'm going to use a random name picker. And pick a name. Cryptic Commander John, how are you, brother? Thanks for coming tonight. I do have something to show on my phone. Hopefully it'll look all right. Let's see here. Um, how am I going to do it? Um, through the email? So I picked up a shirt tonight from uh, the one and only Ed Beer Jr., the artwork is phenomenal. You can always go over to his uh, page on YouTube or on Facebook. Let's see here. Junior. It's right here, baby. Oh, is it going to show up all right? Oh, you can't even see it. Son of a biscuit. So it's a yin yang with dragons involved. It's awesome. I will shut off once I, it arrives. Yes, hit the button, please. Hit the button. And, uh, you know what? If you go onto my YouTube channel or my Facebook channel, Facebook, I'll post it on my Facebook so you so you guys can see the yin yang and the dragons. It's wicked cool. T-shirt. I just posted it. If you guys want to check it out, welcome, welcome. How's everybody doing? <clears throat> Let's see, I watched it on my PS4 when I thought I watched it on my phone. That works too, there, Dane. I watch stuff on my PS4 all the time. V, how are you? Thanks for subbing. <clears throat> You're one of the new ones from uh, last week's shout out or the week before that. Glad to see you. Thanks for coming. How long are you going to be streaming? Because I need to take care. I need to care. Go, some go right ahead, Tim. Do what you got to do, brother. Uh, I'm doing okay. A little, little bit of pain. My physical therapist messed up my foot today. Um, I got plantar fasciitis. I guess it's ligaments that are uh, getting beat on by... Standing on for eight hours a day, I guess. I don't know. 
but it's very painful and I'm dealing with it. Um, just to let everybody know, I was an addict. I've been clean for about 16 plus years now. Um, I take ibuprofen, I ice it, I do what I can to deal with the pain. Yeah, I smoke pot. So sue me. It, sometimes that doesn't even help, you know. It, it's just one of those things you got to deal with. <clears throat> just hoping you still be going when I get back. I hope so too. It'll be in about at least an hour, you know. Dane, have you tried? That's what I forgot. I was at Walmart today and I was going to pick them up. Son of a biscuit. So, <clears throat> with the cards that are in the mail, somebody else received their cards today. So, I'm hoping that Bobby Z will get those cards sometime soon, fingers crossed. Because you guys know how I pack the cards. So, they can't be falling out of, the, out of the envelope. There's no way. You guys have received. I'm very anal about how I package my cards to send to you guys. So, hopefully, they either get sent back. Or they get sent to you guys, and then, you know, worst comes to worst, I'll send you some more cards. But I appreciate you guys. So, you know, I know those were some pretty nice cards that got sent out. We got some more coming up tonight. Okay, so Dane hasn't received his yet either. All right. Well, maybe the USPS is learning a little slow. Fingers crossed. DJ Longhair in the house. How are you, DJ? All right. So now that we got a good amount of people in here, this is for the wonderful people that came by and watched the Commander Legends uh, box opening on the premiere. It was a surprise premiere. It wasn't a hump day, but uh, probably a problem at the post office or something. Eminem. Yeah, right? <laughs> so this is the first card. Uh, Thrill Possibilities. I believe that's what that one is. And then we've got... Bang. Tyrite Sanctum. And a foil Inga Runeyes as a thank you. Yes, happy birthday to DJ Longhair. Happy birthday, brother. I'm so psyched to get that shirt because uh, I did ask Ed Beard to sign the shirt, so he's going to sign it for me. You think I'll wear it maybe once, but then I'll keep it as a I might even hang it on my wall right back there or something, you know? Show it off, you know? <clears throat> so, um, yes, if you if you're looking for any artist proofs from Ed Beard or any type of stuff, here is his uh com my cap locks on www.edbeardjr.com yes he did Bobby Z him and I we actually chat like on uh, Facebook Messenger yeah it's pretty cool it's a, it's an honor for me you know I'm honored to talk to him and you know it's pretty cool he's a great guy yes he is he's very helpful in the community he loves his his art and we love it too so i don't know if you guys have seen the the signed card that i got from him from luke from 570 gaming if you haven't checked him out go check him out go check out dj long hair mtg landhead we got a lot of great people in here tonight. Thank you guys for coming. So there's that. Um, 
Talk about that. I did order a Modern Horizons 2 bundle. Had to. It, I want one of those dice. <laughs> All right. Now I got to look through these cards and figure out which ones I pulled from that. There's that. I will show Dark Raven a chitter chatter thing. Let's see here. Scion. There's emissary. No, was it? Yes, that was in there too. So there All right, a little show and tell. All right, and I will take them out of the sleeves because the sleeves make them reflect a lot worse, worser. So Grim pulled me this lovely art card right here. I don't know if you'd call it an art card, but foil. The charm is the art mage's charm. Very pretty, very shiny. There's one. Yeah, it's going to take me a minute to put them back in the sleeves, but got to do it. Here's one that I was excited about, too. I'm excited about all of them, but the... Merc Tide Regent sketch card. That's pretty dope. Love the blue. Love the little orange marker right there. <laughs> Love my dragons, baby. All right. Then we got another dragon. Turn made me an awesome bag with one of my favorite bands. Beal on it. Nice. That's wicked. Then we got Sign of Draco. There we go. Beautiful card. So I've got a playset now of the Scion. Pretty amazing. One's actually a pre release kit stamped. And then Grim also pulled me. This lovely beast right here is Sarah's Emissary foil with the pre-release kit stamp. You dirty. You. Bruce, how are you, buddy? Bruce, not Brett, right? <laughs> That's all thanks to Grim, I guess, right? <laughs> And then here for Karen, hopefully she's in here. Here you go. There is the foil chatter fang squirrely boy. Pulled that out of one pack. It was a one pack snipe of uh, Modern Horizons 2 collectors. And I also pulled the regular, the other one as well, the regular art one. There was the shifted, but not foil. All right. So, until then, we can crack this open. Obviously, you need something sharp. There we go. Chaos within, buddy. How are you? So I'm going to start trying to do some shorts. I know I messed up on the first one, but you you learn. If you don't learn, there's no way of evolving. Need my bucket. Need the bell. Wish I had more space. All right. I'm Jelly of Paws. I cracked two collectors in five set boxes. Zero chatter things. They must have added them to my stuff. I'm sorry, DJ. All right. We already know what the box looks like for uh, Strixhaven. I do like these. The brown box. I don't know. And the lovely 
golden caramel dice. There we go. Then we got a little bit of schmutz in there. The Art Mage Emeritus. I got another box to put extra cards into. Can't go around with the bundle. I got like bundles stacked up. Maybe I'll take a picture and post it on my uh on my Discord. Show you guys what it looks like underneath my my uh table for magic and next to my computer. <laughs> it's crazy. Do you think we will get spin down with D and D set or real? I believe it'll be a life counter die. I don't know why they change it up right now. You know what I mean? That's why the odds are more in your favor to roll a higher number with a spin down than with a regular, you know, you know, D20. That's what I believe. Why would they change it? They never have in the past how many years of making bundles. It's always been a life counter spin down. <coughs> So if you watched uh, the uh, June 30th video, you already know what's in the giveaway for tonight. There is a foily island on it. You One card requires a D20. I think there's more than one. I'm not positive of that, but from the previews and stuff, So yes, we've got two new subs that I'll be shouting out on the video next week. We got Dave Solari. Thank you, brother, for the sub. And then we've got Ike Stoddard. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. Let's keep pushing that number up. I do have a, a, a thought on giving away the spicy cards for the 900 subs giveaway. Should I do three and three and two people? Or should I just... Put them all into groups of three cards each, shuffle them up, and just pick from one and send it out to whoever. We don't know what's in it, and we just ship it out to whoever wins the next giveaway. Then you all have a chance of winning. I'd like you guys' opinion, because you guys are who matters. So please let me know your thoughts. I like the second option. Do what I feel is best. MTG Landhead, how are you, brother? <clears throat> Some chaos. There you go. So mix it into a bunch of cards and just wherever it goes, it goes. I can do that. And you know what? When we do the giveaway, I'll have them like. Uh, like Justin I, MTG, he actually has a bunch of cards already divvied up and stuff. They'll be in, you know, a penny sleeve or whatever, and they'll be facing each other, and they'll have numbers on it or something. And then, you know, the main thing you got to do when you get them, post them on my Facebook, post them on my Discord, something so that I know what you pulled. Bro, my first videos, if you go back and watch some of my older videos, they are ridiculous. Like, I had my can't, my phone in my hand as I'm flipping through cards and I'm bouncing all around. And I'm like, Jesus, welcome to the Casa on my round table. You know, it's about the fun of it. You're right. And enjoy it because, you know, it takes time to learn. Make sure you get yourself a, a tripod. You know, it doesn't have to be an expensive one. I was lucky enough to go to, like, Staples or something. They had a sale, and it was a 
lightweight tripod. Excuse me. And uh, it's been a champ. Hasn't broke. Knock on wood. I did have to upgrade the, the camera holder, though. Because those little chintzy ones that you get with them, they don't work well. You know, I got one now that I'm fixed it myself. You know. <clears throat> I'm all about the, the fun. Let's see. To be honest, my first video was me saying random things while dropping my phone multiple times while trying to zoom in. <laughs> and that's the fun about it, you know what I mean? Nobody's perfect. You know, you see other people bumping the camera, you know. Things happen, you know, just let it happen. And that's the fun about about opening magic gatherings. You can mess up and it's no big deal. It happens, you know, and as long as you're keeping a positive outlook on the situation, all you can do is make it better, you know. Let's crack some packs, baby. Let's give me a box. What else was I going to talk about? Um, let's see here. Ed Beard t shirt. Um, what else? I'm trying to think. Now I don't do a lot of the L video, but you make some animation. It's not quite easy to, but it's fun. Sometimes you make a mistake and laugh at it. All right, Cryptic. See you in a bit. All right, here we go. Let's go, baby. All right, we got a bookworm. Time for bed. Thanks, Faith, for being here. Um, you know what? Is this on there? Oh, no. It was uh, Alex Weaver. All right, here we go. There's the bookworm. Gotta make room here. Oh, almost dropped the pack. All right. Show of confidence. There we go. Let's go, baby. Come on. Show me love. There. Ooh, good card. This has been spiking lately, hasn't it? Elemental Expressionist? No, it's the other is it card, isn't it? And you get a foil. Whoa. There we go. Whirlwind Denial. And a token. Fractal. All right. That was quick, John. Thanks for coming back. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. Trample. When Bookworm enters the battlefield, you gain three life and draw a card. It is a kind of expensive. Eight. Eight drop. Let's see here. Brackish Trudge. Oh, my God. Deadly Brew. The mascot. Uh, interception. Oh, ho, ho, ho. that's an M, right? That's an M. Ooh, let's go. Ooh, there we go. Body of uh, research. Not the best mythic, but it is a mythic. Let's go.
Ooh. Eliminate. All right. And a treasure token. Those will go together. All right. Plus Mr. Beast to announce more soon. I'll get the facts. One second. Let's see here. What did I miss? Uh, no time to bed. Oh well, there's a new MTG rule on one dice now. Really? You, you can only roll it a certain way. Hold it in the palm of your hand and just dump it. There we go. Containment breach. We've got. There's that sword. Gotta love that puppy. Oh, it's a spear. Mortality spear. Good card. Then that warlock. Is that another mythic? You bet your butt it is. <laughs> yeah! What I'm talking about. Nice. Jadzi, Oracle of Arcavios. There we go. Hitting them mythics, baby. Here, we're going to do this. Journey. Journey with me so I can read it better. Journey to the Oracle. There we go. All right. And then, blah! Uh, Doomblade. And an uncommon. Kelpie guy. <laughs> and an elemental. There we go. Got a cool foil. Wow. Doing all right so far. Yeah, we're doing all right so far. That's a good thing. Let's do this. You! There's one of my favorite cards. Fracture. And go blank. I like shooting blanks. Killian. And Let's go, baby. Let's go. Rare. There we go. The accomplished alchemist. And what we've got behind it. The gate. There we go. Nice. And a junk card. Yay. Gotta love that junk. Well, I did it. I pre-ordered the bundle. Nice. Is it the M M2 bundle? MH2? I had to. I had to buy one, buy one at least. Academic dispute. There we go. Next pack. There's the... There's Mari Apprentice. And then we got the Overgrown Arch. And let's go, baby. Show me the M. Oh, rare. Poet's Quill. Not so much. Ooh. That's a rare. Oh, it's a mythic. Is it? Yeah. Three mythics so far, baby. Blue Sun Zenith. You. Yeah. Nice. Look at the hits coming tonight. And a, a token. Blue Sun Zenith, baby. Yeah. All right. 
That's what I'm talking about. What is that? Three mythics so far? Wow. I mentioned you, but it's been so long since I bought a pack. Bought packs. Then they better be supplying us with some uh, D20s then. But I can't see them changing up the printing process of uh, making them dice. You know what I mean? That's the only thing that I can't see. I'll naturally film it for the little giveaway. So stay tuned. Hell yeah, we'll go check it out. Their uh, MTG land heads. Stone binders familiar. Right, true. Here we go. Got the doggy. Woo! And uh, I forgot what it's called. Ten to the ten the. What is it? Ten the pest. Juke! Got the juke. Rare. Bang! <laughs> nice! Double major, baby. You! That's what I'm talking about. Ooh. Another rare. There we go. Cross and grip. I have not seen this artwork yet. I've probably seen it on a box opening or whatever, but that's awesome. Loving it. That's some pretty sweet artwork. Split second. With an inkling. Wow. Glad I picked this bundle up, eh? So yeah, I picked up two uh, collector's packs of Strixhaven, and I obviously did the short, or want to be short, and uh, I'm going to use that other one as a short as well. No sweating on the cards. All right, Devouring Tendrils. Then the Quandrix Apprentice. I don't know what that is. Test of Talents. There. Oh, there we go. Gotta love the snarl, baby. My favorite one, too. There we go. Claim the firstborn. Where am I putting the lands at? I'll put it with the foils. And... Ooh. There we go. We got another foil, too. That is clever. Lumen Mancer. And another junk token. I'll take junk if I can get foils like that and kick butt cards. I won't complain. Express iteration is yes, that's the one I was talking about. That's that is it card. Yeah, it's gone up, shot up like crazy. I just listed mine on eBay. It's a nice uncommon. Yep. All right. Next pack. I still have to do those giveaways. After this pack, we'll do the first one. Barred's fireball to answer the first question. Just Google the card pause. Tell everyone what you see. Is there a card that has pause on it? Also, chaos channel. 
<laughs> A Aether Helix. <clears throat> uh, return of Memory. Then we got the Honor Troll. Come on, baby. Show me them. Ooh, where's that? Here we go. Strict Proctor. Not a bad card. And negate times two. Right? Yeah. Too bad that's not a foil, huh? And an elemental. All right. Honor troll work in commander. Yeah, I don't see why it wouldn't. Three drop vigilance. If you gain life, you gain that much life plus one instead. Honor troll gets plus two plus one as long as you have 25 or more life. Yeah, there are some cards that have that on it as well. The buffer your uh, creature as long as you have X amount of life. You bet. What the heck? Oh, got a basic conjuring for a rare. I was like halfway through the pack and I'm like, what? Okay. This seems weird. Fortifying provisions or drought. Fortifying drought. Then we got the. Oh, come on. That card. Secret Rendezvous. Creative Outburst. And looks like a flippy card. Uvilda. You know, I pull so many of her, it's not even funny. Guess it could be funny. Uncommon. There we go. Adventurous Impulse. Feelers are foily. Ooh. Uh, Berry Books. Here we go. And a fractal. There we go. One last pack. Oh, I said we were going to do giveaways, didn't I? All right. First giveaway is the name picker. Thank you all for coming to that Commander Legends box opening. I appreciate it. Justin Best, how are you, brother? How you doing? I'm just going to roll it once. So we got Karin. We got Pack Opening Attic. We got Dane Piker. We got MTG Landhead. We got Joshi. We got Alex Weaver. Lance in Gold Hat Production. Uh, let's see here. Show random names. And winner number one is one. Name from the rest of the All right, here we go. Winner's going to be. Yeah. Gold Hat Production. Please get a hold of me. You have one week as of today. Congratulations. And I will put that on there. Gold pack. Gold hat. Yeah. Pro look. Congratulations. There's that one. And then we got we got 12 comments from uh, last week's video, last week's hump day video. Final. Let's see here. Inspired by Dungeons and Dragons game adventure in the Forgotten Realms, Intrusive, Dice Rowan, and Black Border sets. Over the D20 or. 
ISO Shidron. This is Diode Dungeons and Dragons. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. That works for me. All right. Set these all up. All right, you guys know what to do. One to five, pick a number. I'm going to keep things the same, you know? Change things, but make it different. Shadow, welcome. How are you? Thanks for coming. All right. Wow. So we got threes. Three's gonna be the be the winner. Alright, I will roll it three times. Good luck and congratulations and all that lovely stuff. Roll number one. Donkey Lives, aka Coach. Pause, you said I won something in the other video. If it's still available, I sent a message on the live stream comments. Yes, I did. I got that, and thank you. Next winner, or next role, Neil Arnold. He writes a paragraph, so if you'd like to go read that. He's a great guy. We chat all the time. Let's, uh, he does say, hashtag road to 1K and stay positive, which I appreciate. Role number three. Let's do it. I can't win, so that was my, uh, I said a special giveaway tonight on the stream. Good luck to all. Faith Parsons, congratulations. Nice. I believe she already uh, dipped out, but congratulations, Faith. <coughs> she has won the lovely island. The Kaza, right? Kaza. Full foily boy. Then we got... Oh, I forgot about that. The resplendent angel, baby. With the little symbol on the side. The promo. And then... Um, maddening cacophony. <clears throat> nice set of cards, right? Congratulations to Faith. Please email, email me, Faith. I will, uh, I know I've got your info. Just remind me. Send it out. I usually don't forget because it's right over here in this little box with all the other goodies and stuff. So, Faith. Congratulations, Faith. Thank you. Thank you all. You guys rock. So, yes, if you're new to the channel, comment on tonight's video. Pardon me. And uh, that's how you get entered to win on my channel. It's free to do. Free to subscribe. Free to have fun. Mike, 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 Mike. What day is it? <laughs> right? So to go over some of the hits we've got from tonight, the double major. Obviously, Fracture is one of the cards that I love. Jadzi. <coughs> Body Research. I think I pulled four or five Mythics tonight. We got the Blue Sun Zenith. And that cross and grip is pretty awesome too. I like that. Oh, uh, Jeremy War Warden. Sorry, brother. Thanks for coming though. I'm just going over stuff that we pulled tonight that was pretty sweet. Um, we got one pack left. Look at that. There we go. Gold Hat Productions, congratulations. And Faith, congratulations to you. Appreciate y'all. Y'all are awesome. Keep staying positive out there, okay? 
All right, here we go. Oh, what is that? That would be dirty. Look, five five mythics total, maybe. I don't know what it is. We got Zimone. Zimone. Zimone and Pumbaa. Let's go. Let's get it. That is solve the equation. And then. Uh, return, pass caller. Ooh, it's rare. Accumulation of studies. Not so great. But can we get some redemption here? Oh, rare. Urza's Rage. Not a bad card, though. And a Spirit. That was a bunch of rares, though. So the equation is an $8 card. It's a buck or so. Oh. Let's see here. Two in a blue. Search your library for an instant or surface card. Reveal it. Put it into your hand and then shuffle. Yeah. Not a bad card. All right. So, did that. Did that. Have a good night, V. Thanks for coming. Oh. Oh, Cryptic. Cryptic is heading out. Thank you, Cryptic, for being here. I appreciate you. Have a great night. Don't forget to comment on the video. Tell you when. So I'm gonna give you positive cards. Hmm. Oh, we got that awesome poet's quill. Who wouldn't want that? You learn. Good creature gets. Well, it's a one-one. And... Oh, I don't know. I've seen better cards. It's played in legacy. What's played in legacy? The Poet's Quill? No way. Is it really? No one have any Pipers they don't want. MTG Landhead, I got I got Pipers for you. I told you I'd, you know, send them, send them to you. <clears throat> Unless you're wanting like 20 or so of them. Then I don't have 20. Let's see here. So let's see. Loose in the zenith. There we go. I'm going to make up next week's giveaway right out of these cards. So obviously, I'm going to put in. Let's see where to go. I'm going to put in double major. Put in. Let's see here. Um, there's Rage. How about Blue Sun Zenith? How does that sound for a three pack? Alrighty, folks. Looks like everybody's dipping out. Thank you guys for coming along. I appreciate it. Just going over the cards that we won, or I won, or picked up. You guys rock. Have a great night. It's been about one hour. I appreciate you guys. That would be a pretty good giveaway, huh? There's a rage, double major, and blue sun zenith. Blah. There we go. I will put that in for next week's giveaway. Short stream tonight. I'll stay on until for the hour. I'm happy to. I just thought people were leaving, so I 
I'm all for chilling, chilling, relaxing, hanging out. Oh, I just make sure to just sweat it all over me. Green. Usually I run an hour at least. Oh, my doubles. Right, yeah. Heck yeah. I'm listening, finishing up my shift work. There you go. Well, I better hit the road. See you later, boss. Have a good night. Yeah, you two V, thanks for coming by. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Good luck on commenting on the video. So you can get into next week's giveaway. Because we got I'm gonna start working on those cards for the 900 giveaway. Obviously, the people that are on the stream and commenting will win these. Just to let you know, it's the Bloodstained Mire. Lotus Bloom. Nisha Shadow Abows. Turgrid. And the lovely showcase artwork. Blind Step Pathway. I love those full art lands. And Secret Plans. Foily Shifted, baby. You. I will be honest, that is the one that I got out of the time shifted uh, box. The time time spiral remastered. Think about it, boss. So yeah. Next week, Blue Sun Zenith. And then hopefully the week after that I'll put some cards all together. I won't know what they are, where they are, and then they'll just start getting shipped out. So there's six cards, we'll do 12, 12 packs, 12 little free packs, and uh, yeah, that'll be fun. Uh, next week's date for hump date is going to be the 7th, 7-7, seven, seven. too bad it wasn't at 7, right, triple sevens, my son's still waking up. This is our time. He gets all my time any other time. All right, so seven, seven, twenty-one. Hump day video. All right, you nice. Actually, for me, oh, is it seven? <laughs> That's pretty cool. So yes, congratulations to Faith Parsons for winning tonight. Congratulations to you. And to Gold Hat Production. Thank you for coming to that live. Well, it wasn't a live event. It was a premiere. And I did tell you guys, if you guys came, I would put your name in a hat and draw it out. And that's what we did. Set up a big shipping box with devils to sell. There you go. From from what? From double mat or from what sets did you fill them up with? Or is it just Modern Horizons 2? Give me pause for the cause and tell Patrick he's awful. <laughs> you bet. Patrick is so awful. <laughs> How are you, Brett? How's the family doing? Hope they're doing good. Thanks for coming by. Octane's Masters Horizons. There you go. Oh, there you guys. Are you guys doing the EDH thing up at the camp or up at the log cabin? Glad to hear the family's doing good. <laughs> mm. 
Nice. What get, what decks are you running, and uh, who's winning? For you, Theros, Beyond, all kinds of doubles. Well, if they're mysteries, mystery box du doubles and triples, hold on to them. Those boxes are getting crazy. I'm glad I have one of the originals. I'm like 98% sure it's got another cryptic, uh, mana crypt in it. That's why I haven't sold it or anything. I'm just letting it collect dust. And they aren't cheap either. They're like, what, 275 300 something like that? They got three boxes of Times Spiral Master. You love it. Uh, right now it's Kamena. Dynamitis, Obun, and General Furious early so far. I've got a nice Obun deck. Hells yeah. Well, good luck to you all, all four of you that are playing. If you want to strike up a match on a spell table, let me know. I'd be happy to get down with you guys. Tell Pat he's trash. <laughs> Pat, you're trash. <laughs> Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. We've got four minutes. No, we got longer than that. I enjoy chilling. <laughs> We've got some good hits tonight, that's for sure. Normally, you don't pull five, five, four or five mythics out of a bundle. I do get pretty lucky, though. I got a few packs of OG Time and Spiral I've been holding on to. There you go. I'm talking about the remastered, the Time Spiral remastered. I've got five boxes of Dominarian. Once we hit a K, 1,000, I'm cracking that puppy open. And I'll probably give away all the doubles that I've got. So... You, all I'm looking for is a regular Teferi, Hero of Dominaria, obviously Mox Amber. Um, if I pull the, the Mythic Artifact, I'm the host. I'll probably give that away. Um, yeah, Karn I've already got, so that'll be, get given away. Sion of Urza. Uh, yeah, it'll be sweet. I will keep the lands because the lands are very key in Dominaria. I don't think I ever got the opening Time Spiral. OG. OG Time Spiral. Oh my glob. <clears throat> Maybe I did. I forget. Only got a few sealed packs, ten barrel, and one Earth Saga. Few others. Yeah, I was happy to open up that uh, Weatherlight pack that I got. That was pretty cool. I got to smell the old school smell. It was pretty sweet. Love the lands. Love cracking some OG tags from my collection. Yes, they are ideal for having a collection. I can't wait to crack that box open. That's where I came in. I actually opened up Alpha Beta. And I, I don't think I got any revised because it was so short-lived. I don't remember cracking any. But the last one I do remember opening was Mirage. And then uh, I went on a hi hiatus until Dominaria, and then I haven't looked back. I've been sticking with it, and I love it. I love the art. I love the feeling of... Tapping cards, you know? It's awesome. 
I didn't know how to play when I was younger, though. Like, we played, but we didn't. You know, I was like that confused. Oh, I'm going to do this, and you do that. But now I know how to actually play. Darn motorcycles. That was great. Dreams back. Some new memories. It's true. It's like baseball cards or you name it. They all have a distinct smell. Truly musty, but yeah. Yep. You. I think my first pack I cracked was Remick or Allegiance. That's a good set to crack, though. You got the fetches there. Or no, you got shopping in, in Ravnica Allegiance. I want the dark and my LGS were pretty cheap. I got a few packs from them too. It's a good set. CMT, Clever Magic Trevor, he sent me a pack of the dark. Let me open it. Pull the blood trip. Which, dang that. So, yeah, I was pretty impressed to pull those uh, two crimp cards. I still have them. You can see at the bottom right there. Crimped on the bottom. I automatically shoved them right in the top loader. I'm keeping a minute. Dave Solari, how are you, brother? What's good? I'll be shouting you out on next week's video. We pulled like five mythics tonight. It was pretty exciting. Uh, Blue Sun Zenith. We got uh, Body of Research. Jazzy Oracle of Arcavios. What else? Uh, double major. Um, what else? Let's see. Oh, we got the snarl. Snarl. I was just showing off those Modern Horizon crimp cards that I got on my video. How's your night going, Dave? Thanks for becoming a sub. I appreciate it. That's a cool name. Let's see here. Did our giveaway. So yeah. Blue Sun Zenith. Double major. Hmm. Faith on that. Blood Crypt is a nice card. Love me the Blood Crypt. I will uh, sleeve up the Kelpie guy. Sweet bulls. Doing well, my man. Strixhaven did me dirty. Oh, no. Way more luck with MH2. I've had some great pulls. With MH2, baby. You. I've got two squirrels. I got one Urza's. Urza's. The. Whatever it is. The. I'm so happy I pulled the. Sort of here, Earth and Home. Such a beautiful card. I got four. Cyan of Draco. I got one full art dirtiness. I got the pre release one nuts. I tell you, I got two dams. I give two dams about it. Let's see here Solitude and uh, Archmage's Charm Foily shifted. 
What am I missing? Merced region. Oh, you know what? I bet you I put it. Oh, that's what it is. I forgot to show you guys. Pulled me the first sliver foil shifted, baby. From Grim, Grim Tutelage, baby. He pulled that puppy for me. I was so psyched. Gorgeous card. You. All right, Bobby Z. Thanks for coming along tonight. Appreciate you. We'll get this card thing sorted out. Appreciate you so much. Chat with you in the Facebook chat or what, what have you. I'm not sure. I never played them. Just collected the sets. What the heck does one do with a conspiracy? Some of the cards are legal in EDH. Um, I think Legacy as well. I know the unset cards are not legal, but are, are some unset cards legal in ED in Commander? I don't believe so. Well, the foot is tender tonight, baby. Yep. Not sure to play them. Just let the link. You bet your bottom dollar. I've thought about cracking that one under there. I got a unsanctioned. I believe. I believe it's unsanctioned. The the newest one that came out. Gold Hat Production. What up, dude? Congratulations, you won. So give me your info. Email me. Uh, brown uh, 28 at gmail.com. Would you like to see what you won tonight? That was from coming over to the Commander Legends box opening that I got from uh, Patrick from. Uh, Booster Therapy. We've got an Inga Runeyes Foily. Gorgeous card. We've got a Tyrate Sanctum. And there we go. The Kitty Cat. Thrill of Possibilities, baby. Thank you. And I appreciate you. And if you could, let me know what kind of land, and I'll sign you a land. They are full art, so plain swamp, you name it, I'll sign one for you. Sub, how has the stream been working? We hit like four or five mythics tonight out of that strict save them bundle. Did all right. How are you, Tim? Did you get everything set, set all up, set up, and ready to go? Or I'm not sure what you did, but get the land, keep the land, sign the extended art. Well, you, I, I'll do that for you if you'd like. The thrill of possibilities. You want me to sign that puppy? Or do you want the Tyree Sanctum? Which which card? Senator. So the Tyree Sanctum or the the Kitty Cat? Meow. Which one would you like me to sign? Because they both are extended art, I believe. Or is this box topper art? You bet. I'll be happy to. I'll do that right now for you. Sweet. Beautiful. 
you show that off to people in person at the comic shop. You bet. Thank you. There you go. John Hancock on it, buddy. Whoop. You gotta love it. <laughs> Dropping my towel. I am a professional. Can you tell? Drop all my stuff. All right. There we go. Neil Arnold, how are you, buddy? How's the night going? Pulled some great hits. All right. Okay. So next week's commenter, as long as you comment, will win. I like showing them off. The lovely blue sun zenith. Urza's rage. And a double major, baby. You. Could just go home from work. What got pulled? These cards right here that I'm giving away next week, those got pulled. And uh, we pulled, what, four, four, at least four mythics. Uh, we got a Cross and Grip. It's not a mythic. It's a nice rare, though. Got a double hit on the um, Negate. Got a Doom Blade. Ruin of Denial. All right, so we got Body of Research, Jazzy, Oracle of something, Ar Arcavios. There we go. My my lovely fracture card. I like it. We got Ovilda, Dean of Prof. Protection, protection, something. I like the card. It looks pretty cool. And what else do we get? Showed off that. Let's see here. Um, I do try and do some quality giveaways. I, I do giveaways as if I would want to get the cards, you know. I don't give away commons or common foils unless they're something crazy nuts, you know. But, yeah, so. Uh, Donkey Lips, what's up? How are you, coach? We've got some uh, crimped foil, crimped uh, Modern Horizons 2 cards. I don't know if you saw the video. But there's one of them. I don't know if that's going to show it. It's crimped. There it is. There's a crimp. You can see it. On that card. And also, Blossoming Calm. Goes all along the bottom. My first crimp job, so I had to show it off. And what else? So, giving away the blue sun zenith. Oh, yeah, my lovely hit. Foil first sliver, baby. I still happy with this card. Cascade. Sliver spells, you have cascade. You loving it. I love this artwork. It's so great. Oh, I need it. Oh, need it. Hump day pause. That's right. Hump day's here. I tried not 
to comment last video until today so I can actually win if I do. <laughs> Doesn't matter when you comment, as long as you comment. And what else do I have here? Any other? Nope. Let's see here. Put those away. Oh, we're already at an hour and 15 minutes. We're doing all right. It's a little warm. How warm is it in your state? My mind state, it's about 120 in here. So what do you guys think of the new D&D &D set? I believe I'm going to be skipping some of it. I might buy singles. But I do have other boxes to open. So thinking about opening a Rivals of Ixalan and do a little shorts of it and do a hump day video out of it. Talk to you later, bro. My friend just got here. Chris, have a great night, brother. Keep staying positive, and thank you for coming by tonight. Appreciate you. All right. Been warm all week. Thunderstorms tonight. Cool us down. Yes. Here in Vermont, too. It wasn't very long. It was just a small shower, and then it just it cooled it down. That's what we needed. The highest it got was like 94, though. Like, not no 120 degrees in the West Coast. I don't know if that's where you guys are from, but yeah. I feel I feel feel it's bad that that hot out there. <clears throat> Let me see it looks fun. Can't wait for the drop. Well, that's cool. I never got to, got to play much D&D &D because the guys that I played with were all older than me and they didn't really want to work on a character with me. So I didn't have the best experience. Main here, pause. Didn't know you were from me. You bet your bottom dollar I am. True redneck, baby. <laughs> I used to cut hunt. I might cut again. Um, I actually went to Dean College in Franklin, Mass. Exit 16, I believe. Yep. Hey, sir. Nice to have you here. Looks a lot of new dragons from D and D. Yeah, that's why I thought about getting a box, but then I'm like, I need to take a break on buying and just hold on to some money. You know, <clears throat> might pick up a bundle though. Try and pull some of those dragons that I want. Might trade for some. Yeah, born and raised in New England. Proud of it. You're still going live. Franklin Mass, resident. I swear to God, man. This is crazy. How do you coach? Cut it out. No way. I can drive right here right now, about three hours. <laughs> I can make it in two and a half. <laughs> That's awesome. No way. <laughs> What are the odds? That's nuts. 
That is, dude, that's nuts. That's, <laughs> um, so when I was at Dean, that's when I made my name pause. Because I, first day there, I'm like, hey, I'm Paz Brown. You know, I, well, it was pause. And uh, I was like, pause for president, pause for this. So I was in the student government. I was, I was an emergently le uh, emerging leader planning committee member. You're from Vermont. You can make it one and a half hours the way you will drive. <laughs> I do. I, yep. Yes, sir. Uh, <laughs> That's so ironic. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> we were so close, but so far away. Thanks to our buddy Donkey Lips. He brought us together. I'd take a vacation and drive down there and play some cards with you. That'd be awesome. Trucks hunting in my home. You bet your bottom. Yes, sir. You, you, you plug me real good there. I'm proud of the way I am, though. You know, I, it's weird. Me being from a little town in Vermont, like... Honestly, I believe I'm the only Vermont YouTuber that does Magic the Gathering. So my niche is Vermont itself. <laughs> but thanks to Joey, he, he shouted me out and it got me like 300 subs right off the bat. I was very lucky. And that was right when I was starting out too. Like I, I had no clue what I was doing still. But I was making content, and I loved it, you know? It was fun. And I still love it. I love the art. The art is what gets me. I actually went to college for psychology. I got a year left, and uh, I got one 400 class to take care of. Once Lincoln gets older, I do plan on going back. Lincoln is my son. He'll be seven in July. Oh, what is it? No. July 14th. Hell yeah. We need to cut some MTG some time. I'm just busting chops. My not is gorgeous. Love that state. Art is what got me in Jim to do as well. Back in 95. That's right, yeah. I'm going to be 41 this year, there, Dave. I don't know how old you are, but it doesn't really matter. We got some in common. MTG. Still got seven folks here. Who we got left in the in, in the stream? Give me a shout out. Who you at? Who you be? Nice. Keto Investor, how are you? Thanks for coming by. Appreciate ya. How's your night going? Did you crack any cards open? Any packs open tonight? Feels like it's getting hotter instead of cooler out. You know, but us Vermonters, we complain about the snow and the and the hot, the heat. There's not a happy medium, you know. Neil Arnold Brilla. Nope. 
Let's see. But I played some Brawl on MTGA and did pretty well. Oh, speaking of MTGO or A, have you guys seen what the price of uh, the the monkey, the one one red monkey, uh, I can't even think of the name of it. It's like $400 for a play set on MTGO. <laughs> That's nuts. For, for, you know, not physical copies, but to play on MTGO, it's nuts. Ragavan, that's what it is. <clears throat> yeah, it is. It's nuts. Like, shh. Yep. Craziness. But people pay it. It's about a dollar, bottom line. You want to play in Legacy, you got to pay to play, you know. That's why I love EDH. You know, I like play sets because I can add them to other decks, you know. Up to a higher bucks or just a... I think it's pretty close. Speaking of, let's find out. Why am I going to my bank account? That would not know anything about Ragavan. MTG. Let's go to stocks. Ragavan. Average is eighty dollars and fifty-five cents. Yeah, I, I haven't put it, sunk any money into MTGA for probably about a year now. I still play, but I'm at 120-something so far. Yeah, that sounds about right. I've probably spent at least that. I came out right when uh, actually Joey, the Moss Boss, got me into playing on a arena. So that's when I started out. He he started before me, but I started a little after him. I have fun doing it. I love the new card arts and stuff, but I don't pay for them. Oh, speaking of, you know what? Code card giveaway. Let's make sure it focuses. There we go. Look at that. Screenshot it. Do what you want. There it is. To whomever would like it. Still got nine people in here. Thank you, guys. Juggalo Kev, what's up, brother? How are you? Thanks for coming. Must be me playing Yeah, he, he, he was he was into it. He was into doing just that for a good six or eight months you know i believe i've caught well i was slowed down on watching his live the the arena videos but i still watch every one of his live you know his regular videos we're just talking about Modernizes 2 and Strixhaven and EDH and MTGA, MTGO. Such a good person, man. Keep up the good will and good vibes. I do try, brother. Thank you. Thanks for coming by. I appreciate you. Have you pulled anything dirty lately? I actually pulled it. I'm going to pull it out because I'm proud to have this card. Charles Hat. Carter, how are you? Oh, come on out. There we go. This thing is dirty. I wanted one right when I saw it in MH2. I wanted one. 
the foily first sliver. So I never pulled one in, in Modern Horizons 1. So I had to pull one out of my Modern Horizons 2. And I didn't. Let's see here. Doing it day by day. Is everything okay, Charles? You, do, you okay? Northeast, two guys. Uh, I really want to make a modern menace deck with some of the Chris from H2 and Season Pyromancer. I got a foil of that. That thing has risen too. It's like a $130 or $40 card. I'm so glad I pulled it and I held on to it. I'm glad I didn't get rid of it. Nice job, dude. That's awesome. I hope to pull a rag band. I usually try not to talk about what I want to pull till I pull it, you know? I feel like I jinx myself. <laughs> Oh, yeah. What was it? Where is it? For my pre release kit, I did pull a Misty. Gorgeous card. Lovely. Please look post on my shade and then click it. I did. They can go with their boxes. Yes, they do. <laughs> they left donkey lips. You don't have to be specific. Yeah, just we're up north, Maine, New Hampshire. Tax free. Dave, do you ever drive to New York, New Hampshire to get tax free stuff? I do during Christmas time and stuff. So good. It wasn't quite reprinted in image two. That's true. That's why it's spiking, I believe. It's a quality card. About my mom. Oh, Charles. I'm so I'm sorry to hear that, bro. Ten years. Live for your die. True. Yep. I don't know what that feels like. My mom's getting old, and it, my aunt's got stage four cancer as well. You know, it, bone cancer. Um, death is not easy. You know, my prayers go out to you. I'm glad to see you here, bro. We all deal with death, you know, and it sucks. But just remember. We'll see them again. That's how I feel. In my heart, that's how I feel. Getting me all choked up thinking about, you know, I don't know what I'd do if my mom passed away. I, <sighs> She's had 15 plus surgeries, my mom has. She's got rheumatoid arthritis, and the doctors have. I call her the bionic woman because she's got more metal in her body than <laughs> um, Wolverine or something, you know? You're calling Russell all posted on my post. I'm sure I did. I just, you know, I. My prayers go out to you, bro. One day at a time, and sometimes it's one minute at a time. I get it. You know, that's that's why I wear this shirt, my friend Michelle. 
She was only 38, you know. Wow, we got 13 people. Thank you guys for being here. Sorry, I've been shipped without a buy. My nephew needs some help trash picking these wicked nice stools off the curb. No problem, bro. Glad to see you coming back. You know, Bruce, what's up, brother? I feel like I lost my mom earlier this year. I had last year, and my brother passed away last week. Oh, Bruce, man. My heart goes up to you, too, bud. If you ever need to chat, I'm here, bro. Just like right now, I'm here. Cut it out, donkey lips. No way. That's dirty. Ha ha ha, wow. That makes me happy, donkey lips. You know, that's cool. But, Bruce... My heart goes out to you, bro. And I'm here for you. I, if I can do anything to help you, obviously it's, it's staying positive. It's hard to do when when we we all get a, a, a you're not an acquaintance after so long on YouTube or we actually ha having a. a a socialization aspect of friends and I see you as a friend you know so I'm feeling for you bro I hope to bring you some more good times and if that's what I can do I will do my best Ah, dragons. Dragons are the the shizmanit in D and D. I'm liking the dun the dragons. Uh, that's my thing. I love dragons, but these dragons right here are a lot better. I love these guys right here. The Strixhaven dragons. They're dirty. Love them, but. The dragons in D and D look pretty sweet. I know they're not as powerful, but I'm definitely gonna pick up one of each. And I appreciate you, Bruce. Being a sub is awesome. That's what I appreciate. Good people. You know, I don't ask for anything else except for positive, good people that are here for me to hang out and chill. You know? Cobalt is absurd. Yes, it is. That one drop is absurd. The Drew Bill guy is cradle, bro. Yeah, I like the great cradle too. I don't think it's in it's in Modern Horizons 2 though. You have Maya, right? What are 12 borderless dragons in the DMV set? There's 12 of them? Wow. Drowned on the cobalt for DD. Sick one drop of menace. Yes, sir. That is a pretty spicy card. The 
this. Make this real. Yeah, that's nuts. Just like the Urza Saga. That's, that thing's dirty, too. You know? A land that, that has a saga, you know? They're thinking of everything. They're putting everything on a card that they can. And as long as it... And even if it does break the format, they just push it along, you know? I want Kiamat and Molas. Yep. And the new big green. That's what I'm talking about. That green stompy one is dirty. With that poison something, poison air or some crap. That thing is dirty. I want that one bad. Even though it's a 4-4, four, four, it's got that poison. Shh, nuts. Dude. Turn to kill it in the standard with the kobold. Card is insane. Granted, it requires a god hand of sorts. <laughs> right? But it can be done. Really don't want to cut you guys off. Um, crap. You know what? No, we'll we'll keep going. How about another ten minutes? Cause I gotta I gotta hit to the store, pick up some milk for the fam. About ten minutes. Is that cool, you guys? I want to stay on forever, but I gotta do the dad thing. But we will be here next hump day, and we can do this. Every hump day, I will be down for this stuff right here. Hanging out, talking about cards, and appreciating each other. That's awesome, Charles. Sweet. I'm glad you guys showed up tonight. You know, feeling is okay. It is okay to feel, but just don't stuff it down. Stuffing it down doesn't allow you to heal. You know, I still get choked up about my friend, you know. Every day I look at a picture on the wall and I'm like, some people don't deserve it, you know. Oh, my big post tonight. I feel that these lands, the snarls, are pretty good. Um, well, for the giveaway for next week, I did put in some of the the cards that I pulled tonight. So the blue, blue Sun Zenith was one of the pulls. Got like four or five mythics in the in the bundle tonight. And then we got Urza's Rage. And the major, it was a solid bundle. I was impressed with it. We got Jadzi Oracle of Arcavios. Then we got Body of Knowledge. Pulled a couple in the gates. Um, got a strict proctor. The Mortality Spear. Let's see here. Accomplished Alchemist. Let's see. Poet's Quill. <laughs> the higher end cards are going to you guys. That's that's how I do. You know. <sighs> So my extra set of power nine and set of duels today to pay for it the funeral today. Sorry to hear that too, bro. At least you still have one set. That's awesome. I don't have any fetches or nothing. But do I need them? 
No, but it'd be good to. So, me doing this MTG style is I'm investing for my son. To be honest, this is the way I'll be able to get him to college, stuff like that. You know, that's my main goal because in my family, I was the first one to go to college. Well, that's not true. My aunt went to college, but um, I want an easy way for us to hold on to them and them still make value. And then uh, trade them in for, you know, money when he needs it, when he turns 18 or whatever. And, uh, yeah, that's my, my goal is to hold on to all these cards. They're pricey hits. And then uh, 15 years or so, when he's ready for college, and he's like, Dad, I need some money. Blah! There it is. And I, I've got Shaq rookie cards in the thick cases. You know, yeah, you know, I'm not rich at all, and I don't, I'm rich in love, you know. That's my main thing. I, I do my best, you know. I'm not the best parent, but I know I'm not the worst. You know? So, yeah. Yep. So, sure was just spoke really for her. Yes, I was talking about the Power Nine. I don't know what I might have misspoke on. Yes, I was talking about the Power Nine. <laughs> Sorry that you had to sell it, you know. Whatever it comes and goes. So, amen. You know, it's true. People, I'd rather know a uh, crap load of people that appreciate me for me than, you know, my mom always said, you're better off having 10 good friends than 50 bad ones. So, and I've got a lot of great people on here. You know, and that shows by the number of thumbs downs that I get. Because I I don't get any. And I love it. That's awesome. That shows that the positivity that I'm giving out there is coming back to me. And that, that makes me happy. You know, I love it. It's a way to do it. Unhappiness. True. Very true. That's awesome, Charles. That's right. Exactly. I don't know if I'll be able to get my cars graded for him, but you know, if that's that comes down to it, I will. I'll get them graded in. Hold on to <clears throat> I'm collecting reserveless cards and stuff, but nothing major yet. But I don't need them yet. I, you know. Yeah, my son's only going to be seven. I got 11 years to keep sinking money into this lovely game that I can play along with collect. Just like coins, I love coins too. You know, I, I love it. Crap. It's 11.39 here, and I gotta hit the store before midnight. I hate to let you guys go, I really do. I wanna chat with you guys for another hour. I really do. Um, same bad time, same bad channel. Posse B at the Casa. Definitely have my respect for how much effort you put into trying to be positive. 
influence even when things are pushing me and I will not this too clear <laughs> have a good night everyone that's right have a great night everyone and Bruce my prayers Charles my prayers both everybody thank you guys for being here and get a hold of me on Facebook if you need to chat. Anybody, you know, as long as you're not going to blow me up or, you know what I mean? If you want to actually chat with me, get a hold of me. I'm here for you. Peace out. Have a great night. And keep staying positive. Peace. I'm out. Had a great show tonight. Thank you, guys.